Tonight, we're learning more about three Cleveland Browns players, victims in two dangerous incidents in just 24 hours. Two were robbed at gunpoint and their truck stolen, while a third had his car stolen. Lena Lai has a closer look at the crimes, which are part of a greater problem of car thefts in the city. I'm glad our guys are okay. I want our guys, I want all of our community to be safe. Browns head coach Kevin Stefanski reacting to the news of three Browns players robbed in two separate incidents in a 24-hour period. According to the Cleveland Police report, Browns cornerback Greg Newsom and defensive tackle Perrion Winfrey were at Rumor Bar and Lounge in downtown Cleveland late Sunday night. Just after 2 a.m., they headed to Filter Restaurant on Superior Avenue. We deal with these high and clients all the time and nothing like that's happened. Owner Kyler Smith says the restaurant does not own the parking lot next door where the players parked Newsom's 2022 Ram TRK pickup. As Newsom and Winfrey were leaving, six masked men jumped out of a car and robbed them at gunpoint. The robbers got away with the players jewelry and drove off in Newsom's truck. Newsom later tweeting, it's a cruel world we live in. But less than 24 hours earlier, Cleveland Browns running back Demetric Felton reported having his 2023 Dodge Durango Hellcat stolen from the May parking garage downtown. We want everybody to be safe and we want to get violent people off of our streets. Car thefts have skyrocketed in the city, more than doubling in the last year. We dug through Cleveland police crime reports and found in the last 10 days alone, 209 car thefts in the city, an average of just over 20 per day. However, in that 24-hour period involving the Browns players, a busy time for thieves with 32 cars stolen that day alone. Tonight, fellow players are supporting each other. I'm just glad they're, they're here. And uh, at the end of the day, you know, we, we've got to, got to do better as a community and we've got to set an example. And Perry on Winfrey echoes those sentiments, tweeting, blessed to be alive, we gotta be better as a society. Russ, so far, no arrests in the incidents involving the Browns players. Okay, Lena Lai in the newsroom. Thank you.